Okay, so to start off this look, I already have my eyebrows done and uh, we're just gonna move on into it and do the eyebrow wave. Ooh. So I'm gonna start out with my Neutrogena Ultra Sheer uh, sun Sunblock. I literally just redid this because I forgot what it was called. Sunblock, yes. I'm gonna rub it on my face. And then I'm gonna take my Urban Decay Optical Illusion Primer and this really does give my Face, like a, almost like a, a slight filter to where it makes my pores and everything go away. Next I'm testing out my Black Radiance Beauty Foundation. Why did I say beauty? That's what they are on Instagram. That's not what the actual brand is called. But um, I just wanted to show you guys this foundation, how medium coverage it is. I can still see my um, acne scarring peeking through, but it just wasn't what I was feeling for this look. So I wasn't a fan of it for this look, but I think for something that's a little bit more natural, I would definitely go with this. So I want to give it another shot with a different tutorial. Uh, just for this look, I, I just, it wasn't feeling it. So I went over with my Urban Decay and my Becca foundations that I mentioned in my July favorites. So go watch that. Next, I'm taking my Tarte Shape Tape in medium and highlighting and brightening and concealing and all that good jazz. Yes. Yes. And this is me from sitting up too straight because I have a slouchy back. Anyway, bad posture. So I have <laughs> my Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder in number 30 and I'm setting my under eyes. This is where I discovered that it's not great for under eyes, but it's great for the rest of your face. So I set the rest of my face with that. Then I went on to my eyebrows with my Anastasia Dip Brow in dark brown. No, medium brown. I didn't have dark brown yet. It was medium brown. Then I carved it out with my Tarte Shape Tape in medium and blended it out with my Beauty Blender. Moving back to my face, I took my Black Radiant Soft Focus Powder. I'll have the number down below because I don't think there's a color to it. I gotta double check. But yes. And I'm contouring my face. I actually know I was bronzing on my face. Uh, I don't feel comfortable showing you guys my nose contouring because I feel like I don't do it well. So I'm just gonna skip that and when I get better, I'll show you guys. Then I'm taking my Tarte Amazonian Clay Blush in Glisten and my Becca Moonstone Highlighter to finish off, well, actually I didn't finish off with that. I finished off with my Anastasia Nicole Guerrero palette and I mixed three different shades. I think Forever Lit, Kitty Cat, and I can't remember the other one. Can't remember the other one, I'll have it down below. But yes. Then I'm going to prime my lids with my Tarte Shape Tape again and set it with my Laura Mercier Transition Powder. I'm going with my Juvia's Place Masquerade Mini Palette and taking Burkina and Zulu in the crease and just blending that out and building it up to my liking. And then I'm going to be taking Fulani, and I was debating on going with Ada, but I decided to go in with just Fulani all over my lid to create this beautiful, like, brown all over look. I used to see girls in college do this look all the time, and I really wanted to do it, and I just couldn't find the right colors. And I finally reattempted it several years later, so yeah. Then I'm going with my Jordana uh, Fabu Liner, and this is where I struggle, so I'm just gonna skip it and go on to lashes. <laughs> <laughs> oh Jesus, uh, which is my house of lashes, iconic lashes, and then I'm going in with uh, Zulu and Burkina on my lower lash line. For mascara, I'm taking my L'Oreal Lash Paradise mascara as well as my Tarte Lights Camera Lashes 4-in-1 mascara to blend in with my lashes. And okay, does anybody else have this issue with the paper or the wrappings not coming off of the liners? So I'm taking my NYX liquid, or li sorry, NYX suede lip liner in soft spoken and applying that on my lippies and then I'm going over it with my bow and arrow from Kat Von D the Everlast everlasting liquid lipstick ah, it's heaven and I'm just setting my face and that is it for this look I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial be sure to give it a like if you did and also don't forget to hit that subscribe button to join the family of kings and queens and I'll text you guys in my next one bye guys